There were warning signs that a second wave of coronavirus was about to hit China, and now those fears are being realized. According to multiple news accounts, the number of COVID-19 cases has spiked in some parts of Asia again after weeks of declining numbers of new infections. Q2019 hedge fund letters, conferences and more life was getting back to normal in China just a day ago, Al Jazeera reported that things were starting to get back to normal in China. Much of the nation has been under lockdown for about the last two months as the government imposed a broad quarantine. Wuhan and its province, Hubei, were sealed off from the rest of the country because they served as the epicenter of the outbreak. Now as the number of cases of COVID-19 outside China has surged, the number inside the country has been dropping. In fact, there are more new cases outside China than there are inside. Some cities have gone several days without reporting any new cases of the virus. In Wuhan, at least, cases of COVID-19 remain, but some of the almost medical personnel who responded to the outbreak have started to return home as the pressure has eased. Some students are returning to school, and factories are starting to open back up after operations were suspended for weeks. However, this could all change as the second wave of the coronavirus hits China. Travelers return, bringing second wave of coronavirus according to the Financial Times, authorities in China, Taiwan, South Korea and Southeastern Asia are now pushing through new relief measures to deal with a second wave of the coronavirus. Reports indicate that the number of COVID-19 cases in China has increased suddenly after weeks of declines. Experts say this sudden increase reveals the limits of the social distancing and quarantine measures that have been taken in China. One of the big concerns in China now is that Chinese who have been traveling outside the country will bring the virus back with the. You can read full post on CryptoFans. News, link available in text below.